Okay. Hi, I'm Merrilee Penman. I work here at the School of Occupational Therapy at Otago Polytechnic. I oversee the postgraduate program, um, which is totally distance based and has been since its inception in 1999. We went to more flexible learning in 2002, 2003, um, and we're just growing from there. So we've now got, this year we've enrolled 45 therapists from far north as Whangarei to Invercargill, far south as Invercargill, um, and they're all engaged in postgrad study across four courses, five courses. Um, so what flexible learning means to me, um, because I'm most interested in, in the needs of occupational therapists who are now working and wanting to further their knowledge, is what sort of different ways we can package up learning materials so that they can easily access it. You know, we're resource rich. We sit on all the journals, we have the library access, we have the contact with the expert clinicians, with the researchers overseas. Um, so we're current with knowledge. How do we help the practitioners to get current? Postgrad studies one way. We've got other things called keeping ahead packages, little readings online, quiz questions they can do anytime, anywhere, any place. Download it from the computer so they don't have to be at the computer all the time. Um, and for you as a teacher, um, does this mean more work for you? <laughs> um, not, not now. Yes, a lot. The first year or so I guess it took longer because I had to think about what I used to do face to face and the kind of learning environment I was trying to create then and then think about how could I do that online because I couldn't see them and they couldn't see me. Mm -hmm. So the repackaging of my material took time. Now it's just as quick, you know, I sit, if I've got a face-to-face -face class, I think what am I going to do to create the learning environment that I want and set up the activities or whatever, um, do the workbooks, hand out. Um, and if I'm doing it online, I just sit there and think, what is it that I want to create online for these students? And it would take me the same time now. Um, Probably what makes it a little bit more intensive is the online discussion forum for the postgrad students. That's more time because it's not set. Like I don't know, I don't think okay this week two hour tutorial and that's when I'm going to interact with the students and then not anything more. It's ongoing um, and so maybe it takes more than two hours because I spend a lot more time because I get excited about what they're talking about and then I want to foster that and challenge it and extend it. So I post them another response and then they post back. Um, okay. But that gives me the thrill.